you guys on today's video we're going to be downloading some apps right here on your mac so there's various ways and you don't have to download them all from the app store however if you are this is the way to do it so first of all make sure you're signed in so on the top left hand side of your screen you're going to see store and then just make sure you're all signed into your current apple id once you do that just search for whatever app you're looking for so in this case on the top left hand side once again we're going to see the search bar we're going to type in for example affinity publisher in this case we're just going to pop that open and here it is. So this is $74. I can just click right there or click on the app just to make sure everything's okay. So I can click right here. Once I open up the app, I can see the price again. I can click right there to buy it. Now what's good about buying apps directly from here is because if you have other Macs, you can in fact install these apps over there. And that's not a problem. Whereas if I went to the website and just install the app through the website, then I probably have that cap of one or two Macs that I can install the program on. But some of you may have an iMac, a MacBook, and then maybe another Mac that you are running other stuff on. So you may need this program on three Macs. So that's why it's very important to download whatever apps are available through your app store, in your app store, and not through the official website of that current application. Anyways, for now, we're just gonna tap on 74.99. We're going to see buy app. So I'm going to click on buy app. Once I do that, it's going to ask me to sign in for app ID. Now, technically, yes, you shouldn't do this because I'm already signed in. However, it does that just for safety. So we're going to type in our app ID and then just click on buy. Once you put in your password, it's going to take you here. So it's going to make sure that you, in fact, want to buy this. So again, we're just going to click on buy. And that's how simple it is to buy stuff from right here. You should be getting an email, by the way. And that way you can view your invoice and make sure that everything went okay. However, right now it's actually downloading the app. We're good to go. Right here, I can see that it's in fact downloading. So this will be the full ver version. It's not a demo. It's not a trial. This is the full version. That's why I'm downloading this right now. Now, it really does depend on which app you're downloading, how fast this will go. For some of you with faster internet speeds, you know, something like this size, which is almost a gig, will go pretty fast for those of you who are doing stuff like me downloading and uploading and doing a bunch of other stuff on the site this could go pretty slow however as long as you see this moving somewhat then you're good to go once the app has fully downloaded we can just see open so just click on open and we are done this point in time you don't have to copy over the app to your folder or anything like that so just other apps they download from the internet this actually gets downloaded right away and you're gonna see it popping up like so that means it's just opening up. So at this point, the app will open like so, and you, you can go ahead and register if you like. You can always just put don't show me again, remind me later, or just go ahead, and if you have registered already, just sign in. Anyways, for now, I'm just gonna put remind me later, and I am all done. That's it for this video. If you guys have any comments, questions, you guys can write down here in the comments area. Don't forget to subscribe and rate. Thank you.